Unbeaten in their last nine games in all competitions, and with five wins from six in Ligue and Conferrama, Saint-Étienne are one of the form teams of the moment, and they came into the weekend fourth in the table. However, new coach Claude Puel was missing a host of key players for this clash with Montpellier, including Saliba, Kazri, Debushi, Hamouma and Beric. The visitors hoping to take advantage of Lever's long injury list and build on their 3-0 win over Toulouse before the international break. Well, Gaetan Laborde opened his account for the season in that game and he could have put Montpellier ahead here. A brilliant stop from Stéphane Ruffier, making a club record 304th Ligue 1 Conferama appearance for Lever, taking him ahead of Ivan Kirkovic, the club's legendary goalkeeper of the 1970s. A fine one-handed stop to keep the scoreline nil-nil. Well, Saint-Étienne then breaking on the counter-attack. Dani Boanga striding forward. Slipping through for Arno Norda. And his effort crashing back off the post. Well, that could have been 1-0 for Lever. Really well worked and a vicious effort. But Norda denied by the woodwork. Well, Golders then at half-time at the Stade Joffre Guichard. A couple of chances at either end, but no goal so far. Laborde looking to get in ahead of Ruffier again early in the second half. He wanted a corner, but it didn't search the Saint-Étienne goalkeeper. Well, Ruffier saved his best until a little bit later in the game. And once again, it was Laborde, the man in the middle. A point-blank header and a fantastic one-handed save from the Saint-Étienne goalkeeper. The man of the match on this occasion. How about that? Well, Claude Puel has the best record in Ligue 1 Conferama over the past six weeks and his side came close to improving it late on. Bilal Benkadim winning back possession, a ball across for Norda who miscued it and Miguel Trauco off target at the far post. Lever almost snatching all three points but in the end it finished goalless. Both sides nevertheless remain in the top six in the table.